All right. Oh, look at this. You ever see two squirrels kissing before? Wow. Looks like the one squirrel's into it and the other one isn't. Uh-oh. If you're not doing anything, August 13th, 2022, 6 p.m., meet me at 3rd and Chestnut, and I'm doing a uh, history tour. Uh, and some of this will be, some of this block up here is going to be part of the tour. There we go. Pennsylvania Hospital, that's America's first hospital. Uh, that will be part of the tour. Um... A lot of pretty streets down here. The first hospital in the U.S. 1751. Ben Franklin laid the cornerstone of this building. There's a statue of William Penn. Uh... There was a, an operation theater in there. Is that what they're called, operation theaters? Operating theater? And uh, there was a guy um, who like was the father of American surgery and he would do surgeries uh, in that hospital. People would sit around and watch people, like kind of like the Seinfeld episode with the junior mint. You ever see that one? That's a good one. Here's an old horse fountain. Right here, that's for the horses. Down there is for the dogs, and up there was for the people. Uh, there are some working horse fountains in the city. I think there's like two or three of them. Uh, one of them's near South Street. One of them is near uh, Alfred's Alley. Since it's around noon, I'm going to do a quick scoot around City Hall. Usually, if they have anything going on in Center City, like sometimes there'll be political speeches or rallies or protests. <clears throat> they always happen at uh, City Hall. And usually, they happen around the hours of like, I don't know, 11.30 to 1. So... If I ever come down to this section of the city and it's around noon, I try to stick around City Hall and yeah, this little street. Um, and that's what I, you know, I, I guess I get, I run into city council people, the mayor, you know, it's a good time. Yeah, there's all these little tiny streets. Like this. See how beautiful this little tiny street is? There's all these. This is like, I guess this is considered the neighborhood. They got some really old street signs. I think that's from the 40s, that sign. There's a lot. There's a lot of that. Little tiny side streets. And the cool thing is, if you're into street paving, there are so many different styles of street paving in this section. Bricks, Belgian blocks, cobblestones, marble slabs, concrete. Those are one of the... This is my favorite spot in the city right here. This is my favorite thing. I love this. I don't know what the story is with this. But I love it. And I'm going to show it to you. And you're going to be like, why do you love this? 
This is Jefferson Hospital. And this, this fence. This fence, which, you know, you just easily walk around. They lock, they lock this up every night they lock up this little thing it must it must have some symbolism but um i love that i love that that's somebody's job hey jim did you unlock the fence that goes to nowhere ah shit i forgot listen jim we can't open the hospital unless you open up that fence fucking jim jim calls out what do they do how many keys how many copies of the keys to that fence do they have so many questions This is Walnut, 11th and Walnut. There it is. Timber knocking down that building, huh? This is the Forest Theater. Named after Edwin Forrest. He's uh, buried, he's actually buried near South Street. All right, so they got Dear Evan Hansen playing at the Forest Theater. The cheapest ticket is $67. Wow. I haven't gone to a play in like six years, seven years. I know, I've been with Cheryl seven years. I haven't gone to a play in like eight years. Oh my God. Now, check out these fucking potholes. Look at this pothole. And this is, by the way, I'm three blocks from City Hall. This is where the city... I mean, look at this. This whole street's like this. Thirteenth and Sampson. This is uh, the old ale house. What's this, McGillins? I always thought this was McGillin Cuddies. McGillins. But look how beautiful this building is. All right, here we are. And this block here, right when you go past this street, you're at City Hall. So that's how bad the streets are a block away from City Hall. <laughs> Ridiculous. No, we'll cut through here. This is uh, Macy's. This used to be the Wanermaker building. And uh, it's a very old time department store. And uh, yeah, you don't see many buildings like this inside. This is pretty nice.
Oh, I like that. That's the uh, all-star hat for the uh, Phillies this year. My daughter, friend, friend uh, works in the uh, um, in that hat store, and uh, being that it's my daughter's friend, I'm not surprised that he's not at his post. I was going to let him tell us about the newest hats in stock here at Macy's, but he wasn't here. At, the, at Christmas time, they do a beautiful Christmas light show called the Wanermaker Light Show. And uh, this whole section of the, of the store is completely full of people. And uh, let me get up here. And the, uh, yeah, the, you see the, uh, those pipes are for the world's largest pipe organ. They go all the way up to the top, and uh, the organ itself is right over there. If you ever saw the movie Mannequin, um, they go hang gliding up there. So, uh, in the movie Mannequin. Oh, they got the escalators working. Come Christmas time, these escalators do not work. And an employee just chuckled when I said that because it's true. It's damn true. We're going to cut through here. No, it was cool. One of the cool things about doing this channel is sometimes I'll make a video at a place and then a relative of somebody who uh, watches the channel sees a video and John Warnermaker's great great grandson who uh doesn't live in this area got to take a tour of that store because of my little dopey channel that was pretty cool there was another uh the great great grandson of President McKinley there's a statue of McKinley over here right just right around the side of City Hall and I made a video about McKinley and then uh Oh, okay, we can just look up, maybe. Um, and uh, somebody was saying that McKinley wasn't anything without Roosevelt. I think it was young Dylan. And, uh... Uh-oh, what's going on here? And then uh, President McKinley's grandson was fighting. He was a little angry. A little upset people were talking trash about his grandpa. Oh, oh, yay! This is the city hall, and this is uh, Center Square. This is what, when William Penn, who was the founder of Pennsylvania, the, made the city of Philadelphia, he wanted the, the city to be a grid-like map. And if you look, they're painting the, the map down there. Uh, there were five squares William Penn wanted to have... Uh, so people could go and like if there was a fire there was a place to go for safety there was um, and uh, so there, were, there was Franklin Square Washington Square the square in the center is called Center Square and that's where we're standing now uh, then there's uh, Rittenhouse Square and Logan Square um, and that is a painting of the map of Philadelphia, that William, that's the, the exact map that William Penn laid out with his surveyor, Thomas Holmes. And uh, that was kind of beat up looking, that painting. Gets a little worn down. And uh, now it's getting a little touch up, a little coat of paint. Oh, 
So the car is down here. Has it been two hours now? There's some parking spaces. Like if you wanted to park here, you had to pay for a meter. You had to pay to park. Whenever I come to this section of the city, I usually never, ever, 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 ever pay for parking. It's something... i much rather walk a half a mile than deal with the anxiety of a meter running out. Um. We go back here. Remember Cherry Street Pier where we were earlier? Well now we're back on Cherry Street. This is the uh, Pennsylvania Academy of Fine Arts. I don't know why there's caution tape around the airplane. Now when this airplane was installed, it was a greenhouse inside of this part of the airplane. And then, yeah, see it was called the Grunman's Greenhouse. Uh, but the thing is, the, the plants died, like, pretty quickly after being installed. So now it's just like a crashed airplane. I wonder if it's going to stay there. I hope it stays there. I kind of like it. I don't know why. This is Broad Street. The two main streets in Center City are Broad and Market. Um, <laughs> last summer, or actually, we're coming on a year almost. Hurricane Ida. A year ago, uh, we had a bad hurricane. And this highway was completely underwater. It took a few days to get that cleared. I went to school around here, and uh, there's a lot of construction going on. And uh, like this used to be the Philadelphia Inquirer building, um, and now it's the uh, police headquarters. It's good that the police are here because the police used to have a spot called the Roundhouse that they had they used as their building and uh, that building was full of mold and uh, so they sold that building and now it's condos so who the hell would want to live in the I mean I'm sure they had to clean it but
Well, listen, if you made it this far, I got, I got some good news for you. You joined the club, and that club is the most prestigious club in the internet. It's the All The Way Club. So if you made it this far in the video, what I need you to do is, uh, if you like this video, do me a favor, hit the thumbs up, and while you're at it, hit subscribe. Don't forget to check out my merch. My merch is fire, we got it! Don't forget to check out my merch. My merch is fire. And if you want to help me out, there's a link below in every video to my Patreon. You get bonus videos and a postcard. And in the comments, if you made it this far, I need you to write Yokaz. A part of the All The Way Club. Looks like you're not going to make it because you're going to get hit by a car. Well, make sure you hit like and subscribe. And I'll sail with you later. Toodles!